I drove all the way the hell out here to South Austin, and sure enough, it's fucking raining. Um, we'll see if they'll let me in the parts lot, and uh, we'll go from there. Well, the weather cleared up, but not in time for the uh, for the junkyard to uh, tell everybody to screw off. So I'm just gonna do a quick little quick little update on the 88 240 DL. Uh, looks like we've managed a lot of the mechanical issues that the car came with originally. Um, and it is a Craigslist car uh, that I picked up for a couple of hundred bucks. This is way better than I could ever imagine as a prime example of what could go absolutely right during any one of those transactions. And this is one of those transactions that I think went absolutely amazingly for what I paid for this car. It's not giving me any sort of pushback on the repairs that I'm trying to perform. Most of the mechanical issues have been mitigated. I got a working a Speedo and a, oh, hello neighbor. <laughs> got a working uh, odometer again that's in there. It, we've been turning over the miles. Oops. Not a lot of people can say that they have these and that they work. And uh, But I do and it works fine. Um, interior. Uh, it's kind of beat to hell. Gonna need kind of an overhaul in here, but the, the brown really does uh, really does a number on the senses. I'll tell you what. Any who's it coming around here to the B230F, uh, the power source here in my 88 240, went ahead and uh, mitigated some of the issues that the previous owner left me with, such as a faulty battery. Uh, you know, uh, a shitty air filter. Went ahead and replaced the uh, the AutoZone, uh, you know, distributor cap there that they left me with, with the appropriate Bosch one, along with the rotor inside. I got my nice bougie cord, spark plug cables. We're not seeping as much oil from the cap as I thought we were going to be. May have to get in there and replace my oil sump uh, down there in the PCV system. That's a pain in the ass to get to and I don't want to quite do it unless I like really have to. Uh, psh, shit. Oh yeah, IPD performance coil cable. Oh yeah. That's gangster's fuck. Either way, I mean, shit, we're running, we're driving, uh, clocked over 100 miles in the past week or so, just trying to shake out any of the last remaining mechanical issues, and we're maintaining temperature. Can't quite get my fuel gauge to do what I'd like for it to do, but other than that... Hope y'all enjoyed this little Goldie 240 update. I'm going to keep on updating as I keep on making repairs and adjustments and uh, advancements and all that fun shit. Stay tuned.